So I'm here in Slotfest 24 with Maurizio from Slotit and Polycar and he's brought his fabulous uh, track system. Now one question I wanted to ask you Maurizio is uh, what have you brought this year that's new? Okay, well we have track wide. The lane changer here, the lane changer is working. Um, it's actually at, at, the, at the moment used in an analog track but if I had like we have an oxygen car here I can show you that we could run and uh, well I'm, 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 a, I'm aware that that is the finished full production it is it is item yes when is it likely to be available in stores well the first units are available now but because it's a very complex item we have decided to start selling a few to some selected customers so to make sure that they when we have mass sales later this year everything is working yeah as it is as and, and if, if there are any problems you're dealing with the correct people exactly. yeah exactly. so what was the last change that you made to it because um 2018 two years ago yeah no well, 2022 yes I raced on the prototype at the Le Mans yes. circuit and well, I made a small video then. If anyone wants to view that, just look back in my channel to 2022 and you'll see this in prototype form where it's in about four pieces, I think it was at the time. It was two, probably, but it was two lane changes. And the, uh, and the rails were clearly bent and they chinked and you'd had to flatten them. And yes, uh, that because was it was handmade. It was handmade, handmade. yes. But uh, the shape of the, the design, basic design of the crossover is the same. Uh, what we have worked on very intensively is the flipper yes because it's very uh, i think we made the design that allows the car to enter the the lane changer at a very high speed and then it's the firmware we have been working on the firmware for some time and i think we have uh, so I, let's dig into the firmware a little yes. tiny bit because what i've noticed having stu studied the piece quite closely this weekend is that there is not only that LED yes. that LED exactly. in oh, the that's... in the center that's green just there yes. there's Thank another you. hole there's another there's actually two holes one is for an LED to shine through I see that it's lit and now actually yes it's green because they the controller is squeezed it means, yes the controller is squeezed normally in a digital track it would always be green because all always powered always powered. yes then if you, you see that other little hole there yes I do with a little pin you can uh, there is a push button under this and you can actually activate the lane changer you press once you switch right you, pre you press this one on the uh, one I, on I, the I one guess, touch or, or the other one or the other one no it's, it's, it's trust me I touched it <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> it's this one with one click and is it two clicks in that hole uh, to yes, this one? Yes, exactly. Or, or the other way around. Yes. And a green or red light comes up. Yes, I this saw a red and I saw, I think, an orange as well. Yes. Um, now, don't. I cannot tell you right now the colors, but I think red is green and left is red, as, as always, as in airplanes and boats. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. So, Maurizio was uh, demonstrating it to me uh, okay. earlier. But anyway, when you switch left, it must be red. When you switch right, it must be green. And it's... It's not lit right now. <laughs> and if I'm not mistaken, you can uh, preset how long the flipper stays. You can, Is you, that correct? Uh, it's adjustable. It will be done via the app. It will be done via By a, an app. Yes, exactly. So how is an app speaking it's to the a lane slotted, It's a slotted app, like this one, but it's the the new version where you can actually you see this is the this is the usual, this is the usual connection, yeah. connection app, but with the it won't can will it connect yeah. to it right now? No, it's no, not no, because this no. version this version is not the latest version that we have for the link. It's which, uh, which 166, which is the same yes. one that's on my phone right now. Yes, so exactly. the next version will be able to speak to the circuit board. Yeah, and in, the dongle. Uh, and, and the, the new dongle. dongle. Well. So in there, there must be a Bluetooth receiver for that. To there is. The, ah, I there see. is a Bluetooth receiver. Uh, it is a member of the oxygen system, just like the SCP3 
the of the latest versions of the of the controller, I guess, P3. Yeah. The, the B2 chip, the C chip, and uh, what else? And the dongle. I see. So you, um, I know that uh, I know about the new the, the new. Let's call it the new dongle. It's been around for a while now. Yes. Oxygen Four has been yes. around for a while now. Did you bring anything else to the show that's new? Yes. Uh, Electronics-wise, 